everyone welcome back to the blooming egg channel my name is yemi and this is my husband dio and hello everybody good afternoon yes uh, i've always been the lady behind the camera some of you may know me and some may not uh, but today we are going out to check up on a property right two. okay on two properties <laughs> <laughs> so we want to see if they are can you say more about this sure Um, hello everybody, once again, uh, Jagede here. Um, first of all, let me say thank you for staying with us. Thanks for watching. I uh, appreciate your viewership. Uh, thanks for subscribing. So, as most of you, uh, you saw the first video we did, how to flip as a beginner. We are making progress. Uh, we have more investors. We have things going on good. We are in the process of acquiring two new properties. One is in Galan, one is in Dallas. Everything is in the DFW uh, Metroplex here in Texas. So, the first property we're going to is the one in uh, Galan. Uh, I'm going to call that, uh, I think that's Project 3. So we're going to Project 3 first. Um, just want to go and see what it looks like. Uh, I want to, uh, you know, we're going to show you the front and back uh, of the property. I'm going to be there with my contractor and my realtor to scope it. We're already under contract, so we are, we are going to close uh, sometime in a week or two. So the goal is just to go and check it out, work with my contractor, see what we need to do, and uh, you know, uh, start putting our plans together so that when we close, we will get moving. So, expect uh, videos that will be coming up about uh, the, uh, both the Galan and the Dallas property. I think uh, each... Um, each uh, project should be probably six episodes. Uh, we are trying to make sure that we manage how we release, uh, you know, what we show you, and we don't want to overdo uh, the process. So something like uh, each project should have uh, the property walkthrough. Uh, it should have the demolition. After we do the detailed property walkthrough, the demolition, how we start breaking things out, then the renovation. We are going to break the renovation into two parts. First is going to be um, the first few weeks. So let's say if it's going to take six weeks, uh, we'll make sure we, we record the renovation for week one to three into one. Then renovation two is going to be week three to six. So we'll have two videos to talk about renovation A and B. Then the next one, that'll be like the fourth video. The fifth video, we'll talk about you know the final um, walkthrough when we have this completed. Then finally, the sixth video is going to talk about you know how much we made, the profit, the numbers, I'll get into details of sharing the numbers, the mistakes, what we can do better, how long the property stayed on the market. So, each video should be probably like six episodes uh, going forward. Um, I think that's about it. It's going to be interesting. Uh, things are getting busy. <laughs> Every weekend seems to be, uh, you know, uh, our weekends this uh, is now being taken over by recording, you know, showing you what we're doing, making progress. So we are really excited, you know, for these two new uh, properties that we're about to acquire. Uh, my wife, as usual, the camera lady, so she'll be showing us the front and the back of each property. So I think that's about it. So follow along on the journey. All right, thank you. So, babe. Yes. Uh, so today we're just going to see what it looks like, mm -hmm. right? I haven't really bought the property. Okay. Or the properties because there are two. Right. Um, we just want to go and. We are under contract already, so technically we are going to buy it, all things really poor. Uh, the title company is doing the, the title search and uh, we pay the earnest money, which is like a down payment. So uh, all we need to do now is uh, work with the title company, sell our provides all the documents, we the buyer, we provide all, the, all our documents, then we go through closing. So that takes like another one or two weeks, then property will be housed, so, we're still going to start working. So for us to even go on that contract in the first place, what made it good enough for you to think, oh, it's the, it's the numbers work? Yeah, um, um, <laughs> yes, so the numbers have to work, and when I say the numbers work, it's, you have to look at the comps, how much is property selling for in that area? So let's say I'm buying the property for, let's use the simple number, if I'm buying it for 100000 and I'm going to uh, fix it with um, 50000 you know, I need to be able to sell it for something in the range of 200 to 20000 so that that shows that I'm making profit 
my investors are getting something and I'm also getting something and we are able to get the principal back out to the investors. So we don't buy property unless we go there with our, um, our contractor uh, to scope it out, check it out. Then also my realtor, you know, I have the team of people that I have to work with. But the realtor will give me the cons of the area. So cons means comparisons. So you're going to compare, oh, if I buy this house, which is a two bedroom, one bath, what is similar property selling for in that area? That is the judgment I'm going to, that's what I'm going to use to guide if, if I buy this property at this price, how much am I going to use to fix it? So getting the knowledge from the realtor and also comparing my knowledge with the contractor because my contractor will tell me how much it will cost to get it ready. So when I combine both, that's what I'm going to use to make my elevated guess if it is worth buying or not. So yeah, before we end up uh, picking a property, there's always a few properties that we've been to, but the numbers don't work. So it always takes a while before we end up picking a property that we're going to work on. So yeah, good question. Okay, yeah, I think this is interesting. Uh, let's, we'll, we'll show you guys when, when we get there. All right. Let's keep going. Thank you. Okay, guys, we have arrived. Uh, the property, look at what it looks like. Okay, we are right here the property. This is what it looks like. I like the fact that it's at the corner piece. And it looks like it's all brick. Um, so right now we are just waiting for the realtor to come and also the contractor so that they can take a look with us and just uh, give us an estimate of how much they think it will cost to renovate the property. We haven't seen what it looks like on the inside, so we're going to take a look at the, the inside too and probably give you like a walkthrough in the next video. But for now, we just want to work with the, the contractor and, and determine what to expect as regards to fixing up the property and uh, just go from there. So this is what it looks like. It's a one story. Look at the, the corner piece. The yard looks good. I like the space. It's a good space. Um, probably need to check out uh, the site also. So. so, this is what the back of the house looks like. We were able to get in. The owner of the house let us in. So it is so spacious and I love the fact that it is concrete. The floor here is concrete, the whole the whole yard like 70-80% of the whole yard is concrete. It is a good space and I think that's gonna be a good selling point at the end of the whole flip and renovation. Let me take you around to see. This is the whole, this is the back of the house. It has this much space. This fence right here is, is a gate which can open. So you drive in from the outside and this whole place can be used for parking. It's concrete all the way, all the way. This is good. Okay, so now Dio is in uh, going all around with the, the contractor and we'll get to know what the cost is going to be like, the estimate of the cost to renovate this business is going to be. And so we'll be able to make uh, some good decisions going forward. Alright, stay tuned. Alright guys, uh, wow, that took a while, but uh, we just finished at the Garden property and uh, it was really beautiful. I like what I saw. The environment is really good, like the community is, is really great. It's, um, it's at the end of Dallas and the beginning of Gallan, you know, even though the zip code says Gallan, but it's right at the end of uh, Dallas. So it's really, really good. Um, I was there with the contractor, I was there with the realtor, and, uh, you know, even the kids had time to play in the uh, backyard. As you can see from the pictures, you know, from the video that my wife uh, showed us earlier, it's very, very spacious. I like the background. It even has an ADU. That is an accessory dwelling unit. Anyways, um, we are done there. We're going to the second property, the one in Dallas. Uh, that's in South Dallas. So I'm going to go there, see what it is, talk with the 
um, contractor to know what we're going to do. Once I get all these details together, then I'll bring you the property walkthrough in details to let you know the full extent of what the rehab is going to be. So, babe, how do you see it? I liked it. <laughs> I really liked it. Especially the, the backyard. Yes. I like the backyard. I like the space. I like the fact that it was concrete. And then they all still also have the like uh, the sandy area where you can do you can plant things, vegetables and things on the other side. I didn't show that side actually. That the, the other side of the house. Yes. Yeah. So I really I really like that property. All right. You know, by the time you do all the renovations and things in the property, it's gonna look a lot different and very nice. Amazing. So I can't wait to see. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 We will we'll probably share more as we as we get along. So let's get on to the other property. We should be there in another 30 minutes and uh, then we'll show you what the front and the back looks like and we'll talk a little bit about it. Then we'll start the whole process. Once we close, we'll be able to assess the property more in details and do the walkthrough in, in, uh, in detail. So thank you so much for hanging in there. Thanks for staying. Uh, let's get to the other side. Yeah, we'll see you in the next property. We have arrived at the next property. <laughs> All right, here we are. So we are here. Let's go in and see uh, what it looks like. I think uh, this is going to be a simple fix. It should take us uh, probably four weeks. So let's see how it goes. All right. Okay, we arrived at the second property. Not sure what to expect here. Uh, the neighborhood looks pretty good. Uh, I can see different houses of the same type, like one story. And uh, we're not sure what to expect on the inside, but we're going to find out. Um, and we're just going to go through the same process like we did in the first uh, with the first property. So just to talk with the. Uh, the contractor and just take a look at everything that needs to be worked on and then give an estimate so follow along with us and see you this is the backyard yeah you can come on then god it's the grassiest grass i've ever seen ah. really uh, yeah. green, green grass. This is so much let's just watch it and back and look there's even little electrical lines in his backyard yeah. Uh, for the second bathroom, we'll change the bathroom, the bathtub, the yeah. toilet, but we will clean the cabinets. Uh -huh, yeah. We'll, clean we'll the change cabinet. the tiles too. Uh -huh, yeah. Okay. So, clean cabinets and replace handle. Mm -hmm. and we have to buy a bucket mm -hmm. and we have to put it everywhere. Remove the kitchen cabinet and add shelves. Oh yeah, maybe one or two cabinets. So everything, everything is clean, yeah. Perfect. With the light, with the quad, mm -hmm. and then make it like mm -hmm. perfect. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, how many? So, if you lay on this side, just like the cabinet, we just buy the cabinet and we just put it. Okay? So it's very tall. No, I'm not going to my mom. No, I'm not going to come on. No, maybe my sister. I'm not going to come anymore. 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 I'm not going to come an
Yeah, Yeah, the master box. And Mm -hmm. yeah, they have to check. I saw the other way. Mm -hmm. No, it's not fancy. So it's cheaper there? Uh huh, yeah. it's cheaper. Everything's yeah. cheaper there. In Abu Dhabi? Yeah. 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 I don't know where they are. Yeah, anyway. Why don't you buy two for me? Okay, I'll buy yeah, because they're Buy two, bring it outside. Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah, close to your house, buy me two locks. I'll give you the money no, for you. No, yeah, I'm buy I'm buy two. Yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll make sure I pay separate for that, okay? Four, four. Yes. Oh, you want to give me? Just give me two. Yeah. No problem, we use so I'm reusing. Yeah. So, I hope we get some thousand yeah. All right, so let's do this. Let's, um, yeah, like five more bucks. Yeah, <laughs> let's, yeah, let's, uh, let's, let's put on Friday. You can yeah. close for both. Uh -huh. Saturday, I'll come grab the keys, whatever the case is, based on communication. Yeah. We'll grab the keys, then we'll go from there. Okay. If we need to meet on Saturday, I'll come on Saturday, we'll talk about the money. Uh, how much how much do you need to start with? I don't know, let me see where we can start to go. Okay. Hello and uh, welcome back. I hope you guys enjoyed the tour. Uh, you know, of the Dallas property. Like I said, he said it's gonna be a very quick one. Uh, from the estimate, we're looking at uh, three to four weeks to, play, to fix it. Uh, I was there once again with my contractor and my realtor, and uh, we looked at it. Uh, the budget is very small. I will walk you through the numbers by the time I'm doing a property walkthrough in uh, one or two weeks. But um, Overall, it's going to be a quick one, uh, which should be done in no time. This is in South Dallas, so we'll see how it goes. Uh, but just uh, stay tuned. I'll walk you through the Galan property. I'll walk you through the uh, South Dallas property, and we'll see how it goes. I'm very excited, you know, for both properties. I think uh, we have more stores that is coming, you know, down the pipeline. So stay tuned, stick with us. Let's see how it goes, and uh, make sure you guys enjoy your weekend. I look forward to bringing you more content as we get along. So thank you so much. Have a wonderful one. Oh, and by the way, someone said I should take off my hat. They said they want to see my face clearly. But <laughs> let me know if you like my hat or not. I think I'm, I like rocking the hat. Yeah, so, it's lovely. I like and it actually matches my top. So, uh, yeah. let's go. <laughs> All right, thank you so much. Have a good one. Bye. Bye. Bye.